What's up, Cloud Residents? This is Dark Cloud here. Welcome back to the next episode of the Pokemon Omega Red Fire Red 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 Nuzlocke. And in the last episode, I believe we fought Erica and won, and we started to go through the hideout, the the the, 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 the Rainbow Rocket. There we go. Got it. And now my controller isn't working, so that's great. Give me a second. Um, there we go. And I need to remind myself of the team real quick. Okay, so we got an Ampharos, we got a Venusaur, we got a Ninetales, we got a Como. We have Mole Man, I think, for Cut. And we have Charlie the Incineroar. Sorry. Um, I also... Uh, will be fully transparent and let you guys know that I already recorded this episode and um, we didn't lose anyone or anything. It's just literally as I finish the episode, um, my cat stepped on my power button. So it was just like, well, that, that, that's great. I'm so happy that that happened. But, in this one, we are just going to power through the um, rocket hideout here, and we are going to get through it as fast as we can, because I really just want to move on in the game. That's probably not a good choice. <laughs> That's nothing, it's fine. I love that super broken version of Flare Blitz. Uh, yeah, Ninetales got this, right? Right. And you may notice, these guys have level 59s. So in no way am I over leveled at all. In fact, I'm very much under leveled for this. Most of my mon are at least two levels below it, and then some are more. That is a victory bell, which means Charlie is coming out here to demolish it. That's so busted of a move, I will love it. Hmm. I think we should get these items first. Okay, I'm not gonna be able to run through that with speed up way too hard um iron defense completely garbage this takes so much brain power for me to do um i'm gonna go this way and then this way down here, go here, and what did that do for me? More people to fight. Woo! I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I don't know the rest of this song. Oh man. 100%. I'm just like super tired. I was gonna like um, go out with people tonight. And then, uh, they ended up, like, uh, not having enough time to, for me to, like, be able to work with, since, like, I have to work, like, my, you know, uh, six to three job, which really sucks. This fur just used fire spin on me. I don't know what that was actually supposed to be. I feel like it's supposed to be a different mon. Uh, we are getting low on scalds, but we are getting them burns. I was really hoping that would take out. Krogunk. Got nothing super effective on us, we might as well just throw it out. I guess if it had dry skin, that would have been pretty bad. Um, I don't really have anyone that's like super great for most of these mon, but these mon like aren't really that strong either. 
until I get it's kind of hard to judge like what I can actually fight most of the time. That room was kind of worthless. Uh, let's try it the other way. Uh, da -da -da. I'm trying to remember this puzzle. It's been a few days because I, I literally had to take a second before I could record again because I just... I got so frustrated after I lost that entire episode. I mean, no one wants to lose an entire episode, you know? I think I have to do that. Ooh, Lucario. That's not very effective. That thing has close combat. Como, I guess? Yeah, I mean, that'll help. Let's go for Sky Uppercut. Nice. Alright, Sky Uppercut, not Sky Uppercut, uh... Close Combat doesn't have the normal recoil that it would... That it would have, kind of like, a Flare Blitz does. I just want to move on in the game. Woo-oo, woo-oo. Um... I'm gonna go and switch Charmed out. And, uh, let's do that. Just walk around. Nice. And now I'm stuck here. There we go. I'm going to get nice and farther in this game. Um, I'm going to do 100% transparency again and let you know, uh, even after beating this base, oh my goodness, I still had no clue how to get the tea. Like, it still wouldn't let me inside the house. And I, I don't know what to do about that because it said something in, like, Spanish. So I was like, well... I don't know what this is actually saying, so I'm just gonna do something else. Ooh, nice. Ooh, Dark Pulse, nice. I'm gonna look at teaching that to, um, Manaphy. I think it's kinda scary, so Felix can take care of it for us. Yep, air slash, knew it. And you're gone. Ooh, 59. The Zubat. Nice. And the left key. Take that. I don't even know if I've gone through all this, all of this base. Cause this is like obviously not one I remember. Um, I guess I'm back here, so probably. gonna be smart for me to heal up charmed okay I've got some regular potions let me use those first and super tier will what 60 50 let me keep that in mind okay so it's gonna be literally perfect actually Calcium. So he's battled these guys and this door opens up. I remember this part. It's Dragon Claw. Gold Bad. We're gonna go ahead and switch to Felix. Ooh, he's faster. I didn't think he'd be faster than me. Well, Ampharos is super slow to be fair. Uh, this guy's kind of a problem. We'll just Flare Blitz him. It's fine. Nice. I'm, not, I'm really trying to decide if it's really unfair for me to use Flare Blitz like that, where like I basically know that I can win. Can I hit this rock slide? Nice. 
Arbok. I think I'm gonna do the same thing and just Flare Blitz it again. Like, it's just, it's such a safe option. Now let's go for Crunch. Like, there's just no reason for me to risk anyone whenever I can do something like that and just, you know, throw out Charlie and just destroy something. You guys get it. I know you do. Um, sh oh yeah, we got a Mega Bracelet there. Isn't that really crazy though? I feel like... Oh yeah, I remember now. Um, I what I la, 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 la. that's what I'm saying. Um, ooh, that's kind of annoying. Really, he lived and full restored. That's kind of annoying. Oh, we're getting low rolls, that's why. There we go. Keyable. Sorry, Nine Tails got this. Um, but in the uh, Celadon Mart, I can actually buy Mega Stones, and I know for a fact because of last time I already played through this, this thing has Poison Fang. This is not a smart idea. Okay, use Flatter. Um, I'm a little too scared about that. Yep, use Poison Jab. That was smart of me. Okay, it's fine. Nice. Felix got it. Oh, that was it. Oscilloscope. Uh, right, so there's Megastone, in, Megastones, plural, in the Mart here in Celadon, and uh, I already know that I can get the um, Venusaurite, that's what it's called. And um, I found a super interesting thing in this game with... Uh, the Megas, and um, I'm pretty sure it's like in double battles, uh, they they don't show like the animation, not animation, they don't show the sprite of the Mega. It's super interesting, because I like tested it out, and like in single battles, it is shown, but not in doubles. So, it's kind of crazy in that sense. Let's see if I can find it again. Because I know it, they're in kind of like a weird area. Yeah. I think it's this last one. No. There it is. I'm going to go and sell a few things. I know I picked up some stuff. Calcium. Air candy. X speed. And we'll hold on to the rest. Let's check my bag real quick. I want to see what I'm doing on, like, healing items. 37 Moo Moo Milks. I could use some more Pokeballs. So here you can literally only buy Pokeballs. I already have five full heals. I'm going to buy a few Repels. Um, got nine. I'm gonna make an even ten. I'm gonna buy ten Ultra Balls and ten more. And buy nine Nest Balls. And that's it. Okay, so now we have the Silphscope. Okay, so I, I knocked out Team Rocket, right? So, um, then I tried to go in this house, and it says that. So, you know what? Since it's been bothering me, I'm gonna pull up a translator, and I'm gonna see what this actually is saying. Um... Wait, 
there was a thing that like literally said the exact thing that I'm looking for. Hold on. The door is closed. That's literally what that means. Okay, so maybe if I go take care of the Lavender Town stuff, that'll like fix itself. Okay, that's not helpful. Or maybe... I know I saw Lady in the Mansion gave me some tea. Yeah, so I guess it's just like, it's closed at the moment. So literally the only thing I could think of last time as well to do was just to, um... Um... To go back and do the, uh, Lavender Town stuff. Which, I mean, I guess I'll do again, because, like, I don't actually know anything else to do. I also uh, finished up these trainers that were over here because I really despised these trainers, because earlier in the uh, Nuzlocke, uh, one of these trainers just destroyed, like, half my team. So I'm now going to take revenge. And revenge is sweet. That is all I need to say about all of this. I totally am not super awkward, I swear. Here. I didn't even see what's coming out. Oh, it's a mug. That's actually kind of scary. So is that. Oh, I'm fine. Oh yeah, we learned Dragon Dance too, so I'm gonna forget to reach again for that. Cause like, if I really wanted to, I could just set up Dragon Dance and that'd be sweet. I can't decide if I want my mic closer to me or not, like... I think it's getting picked up just fine. I should still be able to knock this out. Yes. And... Oh, yeah, I do not feel safe with that thing. There we go. Badoof. Charm can definitely take care of a Badoof. Oh no, it's using curse. Oh, it's dead. Oh yeah, we learned Outrage too, which I think. Like, it's a super good move. I do already have nine tails. Um, and Swagger, I feel like, can come in handy in certain situations. I feel like having something like that is important in a game like this. I think I'm gonna have to pass on it. Like, I didn't last time, and I actually taught it, but on further consideration, I don't think it's the smartest play right now. Oh yeah, I did this double battle too. Yeah, th this is where I tried um, Mega Evolving the first time. Oh, I didn't equip it, darn it. It's no big deal. That's nah, gonna do absolutely nothing. Let me go ahead and equip that, because that is super important. I also found out that literally none of my Pokemon are holding items, so you have Crunch and your Dark type. And I think that's literally like all I have. Uh, oh yeah, that's right. And gone. I think he has like two Salandids and then a Salazzle, so this is kind of a wash battle. <laughs> Get it, wash. That's funny. And then I also... nope. Not that. I already got an encounter there. There's this item up here. 
that is an ability capsule. Oh yeah, it says caps. Like, I want to see if it was just... Yeah, it's just one, so that's the official name. I feel like caps implies plural. Okay, now we're just gonna go ahead and get through Lavender Tower here. Because, once again, this is something I already really went through. And I actually do have it. Oh yeah, Rival Battle, I forgot about this. Unpheasant, very interesting lead. He has level 45s. Did it say Chespin? Oh, I want to see this. It did. He has a level 46 Chespin. That makes more sense. Having a Blastoise now. Uh... Ooh, we can use Mega Venusaur here. It's a great time for you guys to see this. So I just add that, and then Torm Floral. Gone. It's crazy that the trainers to the left of Lavender Town are stronger than my rival. Um, I guess a Psychic type would work. Oh, check this out, guys, though. So. They actually have, like, the sprite for Mega Venusaur. It's pretty cool looking. Oop. That was bad. Well, since I know it's gonna use Psycho Cut. Or Swords Dance. If I had a fighting hit move, that would have been really bad. Then he has an Elekit. His team makes no sense at all. Oh no, I'm paralyzed on your last Pokemon. <laughs> you stinker. <laughs> oh man. So it looks like I'm gonna actually like really destroy this place because if his levels were only in the 40s, that means I am way overpowered for this, even though you're not supposed to go through here really till you get the Sylph scope. It seems like the person who uh, changed the levels in this game made it more like, um, made it more like you were going to do all the training here first. Yeah, that's definitely what it is. That's super interesting. I don't know why you would come here first. Like, I feel like most people who know the game will know not to come here until you get the self scope. Because there's no point because you can't finish it. I can't touch that thing with this. You got a rock type move. Doesn't Grudge, like, if you kill them, take all your PP of the move that you killed them with? Oh, we got a Phantom. That's adorable. Do you still have Thunder Wave? Yep. Nope. Oh, there we go. And I picked up some extra Nest Balls, so you're mine. Easy pickings. Um... I'm gonna call him Keel. We can Keel haul him. Because that's a boat term and that totally makes sense with the tree stump thing. Yes. Okay, I was about to say, it seems like, like all these people only have one Pokemon, which is kind of weird. There we go. I'm also kind of attempting to find the, um, the, uh, healing square. Aw, a pumpkaboo. I'm gonna go ahead and fight this guy. Ooh, you're gone, Ghastly. 
Wow, that's all they had. There it is. Ooh, I would have loved Litwick. Litwick's such a good mod. Ooh, Gengar. I was scared it was gonna destiny bond me. See, that makes more sense to have a single mod of that. Oh, I got a cleanse tag, nice. I don't think I have any mods with ghost type moves at the moment. Ooh, I would love the Hone Edge too. I'm gonna activate a repel here in a second. Ooh, Dusk. That thing would have eaten my attacks had I, uh, came here at the right time. Ooh, and a Gorgeist. Very nice. Dewblade? We're just, like, ramping it up now. Got a Great Ball. Crazy I encountered a Phantom whenever there was all these, like, actually, like, pretty dang good Mon in here. Aggies. It's fine. We can go right back in the healing square. See, that's why I kind of wanted to, it's like, ooh, nugget, nice. Ooh, you're gone. Wow. The bulk in that drift bloom. I mean, drift bloom must be crazy. Will I one-shot this Haunter? Yes. So just not Gengar. Ooh. I'm having a good time just running through this. And you're gone. Ooh, no, not quite. But you're burned, so it doesn't really matter. So I'm just gonna Acid Armor. Frostlass. Okay. 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 Not as much fun. Still, really? That's another thing I feel like was changed in this game, was the rate you hit yourself in confusion. You're that, or I'm just very unlucky. Ooh. Okay. Well, I couldn't tell. I was gonna see, because it didn't say it boosted its uh, stats with um, stockpile, but then I crit it, so I couldn't tell, because, you know, crits go past status changes, so it wouldn't really matter. I'm guessing it must have technically been in sword mode, because if it wasn't in shield mode, there was no way that should have killed. Does it have its ability? Nope. That home clause was completely worthless. Okay, I think this is the end of the tower anyway, so I'm not gonna run back and heal. Ooh, Death Stone. Nice. Yep. Be gone, intruders. Arr. That's such a good story. Oh, I forgot about this part. The story of the Marowak is just, it's so wholesome and sad, but the, the, the message is there. Man, I really wish I wouldn't hit myself every single time. I also wish that didn't happen. I could switch out, but like, I really want Charm to get this experience. Wow. Wow. I, I don't have anything else to say to that. Oh my goodness, it's trying to horn drill me. That's a nope right there. Try to get out here. We're literally not getting horn drilled right now. 
Ooh, thunder. Let me see what the accuracy is. 70. I can't do that. Charlie is an MVP. I don't know if we would make it out of most situations without that flare blitz. Also, the levels super jumped literally right when you got to the top of here. They were like almost 50 and they jumped to 60 right when you get here. Which I guess kind of makes sense because you had to have the self scope to get right here, but still. It's so awkward that they wanted you to go and do the... Um, do most of the tower and then skip skip out and go to uh, the gym it just it's so weird catch one more yeah sneeze <coughs> sorry um let's see what salt does Pretty good. We we'll gonna need to get it. And you're gone. Nice. 61. That was something with an L, so I'm gonna go ahead and switch out. I can rock. A pseudo woodoo, pretty much the exact same thing. Ooh, he held on. Nope, killed himself. And a magmar. Rock slide it up. Valentine's got great coverage as well. Mr. Fuji. You came to save me, thank you, but I came here on my own free will. I came to calm the spirit of the Cubones, but I think Marowak's spirit has finally left us. I must thank you for your kindness. Follow me to my home. Pokemon house at the foot of the tower. There was an item up there that I wanted. But okay. Okay, got the Poke Flute. I'm gonna heal for a second here. And. I don't think there are any encounters right here. It's the next floor it starts. Oh, wait, I have regular repels. Let me use some of these. Um, it's pretty straightforward getting through here, isn't it? And I can just escape rope out of here after. Oop. Wow, that's... Very Spanish. Oh, Sable Knight. It looks like there are ways to get around, so there has to be... Oh, there's another flora. Okay. Uh... You know what? This is the cliffhanger. We're leaving this for the next episode, guys. <laughs> okay, so we I got back up to where I was and uh, finished Pokemon Tower now uh, and found out there is a Giratina right here. And I don't know if I can actually catch it because like I got the Manaphy, but uh, this is a Giratina. Okay, okay, never mind. You guys are gonna have to wait for uh, the next episode. Uh, so this will go up here on Tuesday, and then it should be Wednesday as next episode. So uh, be ready for that, guys. I'll, I'll see you next time whenever we check out what's gonna happen. Bye. <laughs>